yourself down and be able to help you to get a car and get a house. Thank you. You don't stay in your mother's house at your age. That's true. You're old man. That's true. And you people, you're fighting. That's true. You're fighting and you end up being <coughs> fighting in this house. That's true. I want to save you now. Yes. Yes. So, I'm going to go to my tongue about it. In Jesus' name! After two weeks of deliverance and prophecy. Two weeks. Ah. Oh God, God is amazing. I want God to bless this man. Thank you. He's going to do it because he's crying for everyone to come to God. But God will answer his prayers. That's true. Jesus, my name. Thank you, man. For remembering this man and blessing you. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. Thank you. Brother, where's your wife? Uh, I left it at home. You left her at home? Yeah. Why didn't you come with me? I was, going to, I was going to pray for her if you came. She told me that it's going to be arranged. There's a church in this place. Um, you know, your marriage. Hey. You need to pray, brother. I don't need to pray. Because as a head of the house, as a head of the house, she needs to listen to you. Yeah. He definitely needs to listen to you. But the way things are happening, there are some that will pray for you. Don't okay, my name is Johannes Spium Lotto. I came from uh, Delmas, which is located at Mpumalanga. I came here due to uh, the difficulties that I've been faced. That is why I came here for one-on-one -on -one to see the prophet, the challenges that something that they were oppressing me. It's like uh, bad dreams, spiritual wife. Sometimes I've re I I've dream eating something then after that something it's it's not working out life it's become more difficult but I got the prophets that God will set me set me free then everything will come right I'll get the car I'll be in my own house and uh, actually on my family I'm the only person who want to bring all my family Close that to God. So, man, the prophets or men of God allocate me and told me that I'm gonna do it by praying, not to do it by my own way. But as long as I'm keep on praying, praying, they will follow me. They will follow me to pray God. Yes, as a servant of God, while He was addressing us there, He told me about the challenges that I face at home, and the difficulties and the things that it's not working out for me. So they say they, I need the deliverance and they will pray for me. God will help me so that everything could work out for me. It's not working for me. Actually, it was very, very difficult. My life was not working. In my life, everything even if I try to 
to, 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 to have something. It fails, even though I have, I'm working, but it's like I'm not working because I've tried all by means to do something. But it seems like nothing works for me. Actually, on one on one, they've been, the, the servant of God, they prophesied me the issue of the spiritual life and the loss of everything and something that is not working out for me in my life. He said, uh, I've tried by all means to build my house, but it, I failed. So they told me that God will bless me with the house, God will bless me with the car. By believing in faith to to, to, the, to, 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 to God that will help me. Yes, another thing it says I'm gonna go a better job. Not the one that I've been working now because they didn't give me enough money. They said God will give me the job that I can able to buy a car, I can able to build my own house. No, I'm the person who wants to build my own house. Yes, I'm feeling like I'm blessed uh, and I'm deliverance. I feel free. Uh, I would like to say God must help me, not help me only, but must help everyone who follow God and everyone must keep on praying and believe in God and have a faith.